Tom's River North is ready to complete a three-year climb. From one win in 2013 to a 6-5 record last year. And thanks to an upset win against Lenape in the playoffs, head coach Dave Azarowitz knows he has the pieces to have a great season. We expect to be a top 10 team in the shore, you know, year in, year out. We haven't been there the last two years. We want to get back there. Uh, we expect to compete for A-South or whatever division we're competing in and lined in. And uh, we want to get in a tournament. You know, you get in a tournament last year, you know, we got in, we kind of slipped in, and, and uh, we upset, you know, the, the, the perceived favorite, you know, who was the dominant team and really dominated everybody else but us. There were only three quarterbacks in the short conference with 1,000 yards rushing and 1,000 yards passing. And the Mariners' signal caller, Mike Husney, was one of them. The junior is back to lead an offense that brings back most of its offensive line and some great receiving options in Darian Carrington and Bryce Watts. On top of that, 1,000-yard rusher Asante Moore has the coveted combination of power and speed. He's motivated to be a four-quarter rushing force. Right now, just working on building up my stamina, you know, heard in the media that I was uh, low on stamina, so I'm gonna definitely try to work on that this year and try to uh, make myself better every day. The line that I think is coming up is very physical this year. It's very big in size, and we got a couple guys coming up, you know. So we, we should be really good on the inside and maybe around the perimeter getting uh, outside with our run. The defense is led by senior Deshaun Copes, who has offers from Army and Liberty. He's coming off a 12-sack, 91-tackle season that saw him make SSE's all-zone team. Another key to the Toms River North defense is Calvin Jackson. We're focusing this year on... Uh stopping the passing game. Um, Southern, they, they ripped us apart. So we just focus on those types of, types of things and, you know, just get better by every single day. Tom's River North opens the season with two straight road games beginning on September 12th at Lacey. But the Mariners were an impressive 4-2 and two on the road last year. There is no doubt that A-South is rugged, but Tom's River North has the pieces to contend for a division title. Our mantra this year is basically Focus on the small things and let the big picture clear up. Uh, you know, focus one practice period at a time. And that's really what we've been preaching to the kids. And, uh, uh, you know, we believe that, yeah, we're very, very excited. We have reason to be excited and uh, ready to get after it. We're, we're a very confident team. And uh, it's, not, it's not cocky confidence. It's, it's really, it's all, it's all been built up from three years playing with these guys. I mean, they're all my family. They're all my big brothers. So uh, we all have confidence as one that we could really get something going. We could really have a spectacular historical season. For more Jersey Shore sports, log on to shoresportzone.com.